Okay, now let's look at the problem number 31. So consider three displacement vectors. So we have three vectors, a vector, uh, which is equal to 3i minus 3j, b vector, c vector, uh, use the component method to determine a, the magnitude and direction of d vector, which is d is equal, d vector is equal a vector plus b vector plus c vector. Okay, so let's look at here. Now, let's write down what is given here, first of all. Uh, our a vector is equal 3i vector minus 3j vector. Okay, then b vector is equal i minus 4j. Okay, and then c vector which is equal minus 2i plus 5j. Now, all of them has a unit, which is in meter. Okay, so we have to uh, find the d vector. d vector is equal, say, a vector plus b vector plus c vector. Now, in this case, you just have to add the i vectors to the i vector and j vectors to the j vector okay so let's write down here uh, 3i minus 3j plus i vector minus 4j vector plus minus 2i vector plus 5j vector okay so which is equal to 3i plus 1i, 4i, minus 2i gives you plus 2i vector. Now, what about j vector? So, minus 3 minus 4 gives you minus 7, plus 5, it means minus 2j vector. Okay, so this is how we expressed our <coughs> d vector in terms of i and j. Now, let's find the magnitude. So, the magnitude is... Uh, of the d vector can be found by using Pythagorean theorem, which is 2 squared minus plus and minus 2 squared, which will give you, if you do calculations, you can find that it's equal to, if you do calculation, okay, 2 squared plus 2 squared which means you will get the magnitude is equal to 2.83 meters okay now how can you find the angle then the angle can be found by the formula which is theta is equal inverse tangent uh, y divide by the x component which means inverse tangent y component is equal minus 2 and x component is plus 2 so if you do calculation let me do calculate it so inverse tangent minus 2 divided by 2 which is gives you uh, 45 degrees Obviously, there is a minus, but since we are looking for only the, the positive number, let's make it also the, then let's say it's 45 degrees. Okay, uh, this is 45 degrees, but since we want to find the angle from the positive x direction, then we have to find it in a way that Alpha is equal 360 minus 45, which will give you three hundred. Okay, fifteen degrees. Uh, 